Geisley, tonight, Bridlington Town. The team is a part-time one, ranging from bank clerks to bobbies. Richard Ewart reports. Pounding the beat, former Hull City man, now PC Bobby McNeil, on the verge of a trip to Wembley. Hello, Mrs Fennick, how are you? Yeah, not too bad, thanks, and yeah. yourself? Fine, fine. Yeah. Been doing some shopping. Just normal. In day. the changing room, McNeil's teammates prepare for a slightly less important game, with manager John Reid providing the inspiration. We've got the class. Your results say it. So we've got to get out there now, and we've got to show these why we're top at Premier, why we're in semi-final of the FA Vars, why we're in semi-final at County Cup, and hopefully after tonight, we're in semi-final of the North East Counties. Remember one thing, especially for the lads who weren't here last year, we hold this cup. Bridlington hold this cup, and we don't want to let go of it. Come on, Brenners. Town's penultimate test before Saturday's semi-final at Guiseley pits them against Woolly Miners Welfare. Brid haven't lost very often this season, but nevertheless, a win is all important to keep the confidence high. They don't take long to find the net. Bob Gordon, one of two town players who've been to Wembley before, nets his 24th goal of the season. It's a marvellous occasion for anybody to play at Wembley Stadium, for non-league or league players alike, and obviously I'd love to go back again. Well, it's just a marvellous day for the town, for everybody connected with the club, but to play on the actual hello turf, it's out of this world. A goal from Dave Whiteman seals it for town to give them the ideal boost for a game most, including midfield man Wayne Noteman, thought they'd never see. Early doors, you think, well, it's a million miles away. I think the nearest twin towers you'll see are them at Ferry Bridge, you know, for lads that way. So I think, you know, as soon as you get this close and you really start fancying it. On Saturday, Wayne, who hit his first hat-trick against Geisley, clashes head-on with brother Ian. Well, obviously, you don't think about it too much, but obviously when it comes to, you know, the nitty-gritty, you've got to look at, you know, you've got to look at your mother a bit, because uh, obviously if you don't give him a knock, you'll have your mother on your back. The crowd was sparse for Brid's latest cup victory, but a full house awaits PC McNeil and company at the weekend. How's the team doing? Oh, very well. We have the first leg on Saturday, and then the second leg's a week on Saturday and the winners will play the final at Wembley. Anyway, I wish you the best of luck in your match, and I hope you reach Wembley. Right, yeah. Bye now. Guys Take care. Twice this season, so PC McNeil has to be confident about making that first Wembley trip.